Yosemite. Over 1,000 square miles in size. Welcome back. It is home to one of the oldest plant species on Earth, the giant sequoias, which have been growing in this part of California for over 60 million years. That's pretty cool. That could be our connection. What's drawing the dinosaurs here? The sequoias are familiar, part of their genetic memory. That's and crazy. This land could be a perfect fit for the dinosaurs. They remember the trees. All right, welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2. This is it. This is the end, the finale. This is California, Yosemite National Park, one of the most beautiful places on Earth. The horse is already out of the barn. And we are going to be That's a saying, by the way, setting up a dinosaur park. No horse and no barn. <laughs> what Owen means is that things are already in motion. We have dinosaurs that we'll need to capture and facilities that need to be built. Uh, but not actual barns. Barnes no expedition center, a paleo medical facility, and a response facility. Yes. Perfect. <laughs> the host should give us a solid foundation. So you guys can see here, we've got kind of a big donut. Uh, can't build on this this mountain over here. I'm thinking this is going to be our arrival point. We're going to move inward. We're going to have exhibits all over the place. It should be a, uh, a good setup. But yeah, this, this is the final mission. Uh, obviously, we're starting from scratch here, which we haven't done yet, which is kind of exciting. And... Um, we can really truly make our, our own setup. Uh, should be the biggest, toughest thing that we've taken on yet, but I welcome the challenge. I really look forward to it. And uh, we're just, just gonna get it started here. Gonna send a path straight down Main Street. Grid layout usually works pretty well for us. And we're obviously gonna need all of our, uh, we're gonna need a science center. We're gonna need staff stuff, response facilities. I'm thinking we try to, mm, hmm. Is there a good, we could put these along this way, and then we could start the exhibits over in, in these areas. So let's let's do that. We're gonna do a, uh, I guess, response, or we could we could put them all on on this side, and then start the exhibits on the other side. Let's let's do that. Okay, so we're we're gonna go. We're definitely gonna want control center. We're definitely gonna want a control center. We're definitely gonna want a science center, and we could honestly kind of double stack these. Some of these we aren't gonna have too much in and out. So putting them back towards the back is not going to be a bad thing. So like, let's set this up and then we could have this go here, across and there. And then we could put something up here that might, might, you know, need a little bit better room. Like an uh, expedition center, you don't really need to either. So I'm going to start a second row back here. Uh, I could probably put this like that. We'll bring this across here. Bring it this way. Beautiful. Now, response facility and paleo medical facility are both going to have vehicles going out constantly. It's like we could put our response facility here. I'm thinking just like that. And then paleo medical could go next to that. Would that have fit in here? I don't think it would have. No. Okay. So we can set this up here. This is actually a really fantastic setup. Oops. I don't, I don't like that. I want to get it perfectly perpendicular. What do you know? We've got a perfect spot for a, uh, a generator. Going to be able to put this right there. Going to be able to power everything. And then, I mean, you know, all of our business end is here. And we're going to be able to save the uh, the dinosaurs for the other side. Nice. I like it. This actually worked out, worked out really well. How are you at photography? Uh, in what aspect? I think my right side is a little better than my left. This is going to oh, be fun. I'm talking about the dinosaurs. We're going to want images of the species in Yosemite. Oh, and you're wrong about the right. <laughs> okay, I get it now. We can take one of the vehicles and go on a photo expedition. And, yeah, I know. My left is better. I don't think you're you have still a good here? Side. I'm leaving, but I haven't left. You get it? I'm doing a play out. So, uh... Gone, gone, I'm gone. Okay. Catalog the wild species of Yosemite by using a vehicle to take photographs. Nice. So I like that. Are we just going to take, like, a, a ranger? A ranger vehicle? Do we have... Oh, we've got a camera. No. We've got aim. I don't know. What vehicle are you talking about? Do you want us to take a helicopter? Do you want us to take... Uh, I'm not sure. I, I, I really don't know. So we're we're just going to ride out in the Jeep and we'll see what happens. Hopefully this is right. How y'all doing? We're going to bring some dinos back for you to be able to, uh, you know, take a look at here. So we're going to be leaving our park property. We're going to be going out into the wild. And let's see if we can find some dinos to photograph. I love this part of it, man. Looks like we've got some on our mini-map up above. Ooh, hello. 
This is a, a large herd of wild dinosaurs. Take a photo. Got him. Beautiful. Okay, submit it. $5,000 at the foundation. We got one. We got another group of them over here. So we're gonna go catalog everybody. Get them ready for uh, for transport back to the park and we'll eventually be able to take care of all of them. Whoo, $30,000. Something so close to their natural habitat. These photographs are like we're not just capturing the dinosaurs, but a moment in time, which considering Beautiful. how they got here, feels doubly weird. I think this is as close as we'll ever get to seeing the dinosaurs the way they were 65 million years ago. It is kind of cool to see them out in their natural habitat. I like the driving around aspect. I like, I mean, like, you know, being outside of it's cool, but I, I like this. I like feeling like I'm actually on a dinosaur safari right now. Dude, a safari is, is without a doubt, one of my biggest goals in life to go on. We got somebody over here. I don't even see him. Hey, little guy. You're like the biggest pain in the butt in the movies. Okay. So we've got three out of eight. Just gonna keep on cruising. Looks like we've got some more down here in the valley. Let's go. Oh, they're all over the place. This game is just so beautiful, dude. It's unreal. Oh, we've got the hard head mother truckers. Okay. Gonna make $227,000 for that. All right. Oh, he tried to come after me. Come on now. Oh, we got some big boys in the back. Hey, we might have... Did we... Nope. I was gonna say, we might have had them in the background of the last one. That's why it was worth so much, but I guess not. I don't think we're gonna be able to cut left there. Got a few more groups over here. Some Triceratops, beautiful. Take some photos, submit it. Looks good to me. Some Triceratops bootay. Take that as well, beautiful. We got two more we gotta do. Some interesting music in the background here. Some banjos, folk music. This is gonna be worth a lot. Got a nice, nice group of them here. Oh yeah, seventy-nine thousand dollars, and it looks like up here at the crest of this hill is going to be our last set. What do we got up here? Some more triceratops. Is this going to count as a new group? Not too bad. That's eight out of eight, baby. All right, back to camp we go. Capture teams bringing back the most dangerous dinosaurs. The safety of the public and the dinosaurs are both at stake. I'm your man. And, uh, and I'm your man. I know. Once we have them, we'll get them secured within our new facility. And I know. So be careful. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start building out our, uh, our facilities here. Just gonna bring this all the way against this. And we'll just kind of see what happens. Um, hmm. I'm thinking we... Let's just go along the edge here. This is perfect. Bring it this way. And then we're going to bring it back towards back towards this. And we could cut this up into maybe a few different ones. We'll, we'll see how it ends up working out. So I'm going to make this go directly in line. Is that even? It's kind of not even. There we go. That's, that's all even through there. Your boy likes to, to keep things nice and neat. Let's move that there. Beautiful. Our ranger team is is right here. So we can put our, our entrance, our gate, literally right in front of them. That's going to be the easiest way to get into that one. And then we can start making some vertical lines, depending on where we think they're going to be happy. I mean, I feel like something like that is a decent size. We might need to open it up, but at least we're going to have somewhat of a start here. And we'll just kind of see... Where that takes us. Then we could grab another one. You know, bring it back this way. Do our thing. While we're doing this, we should have some expeditions going. So let's take a look at our map. See what we've got going on. We've got Allosauruses. Herararosauruses. Dilophosauruses. Metriacanthosauruses. Oh, and Phoenix? Yeah, let's, let's, go, let's go after them. I'm going to say let's send some really good scientists. Going to go take a look at that. Trudons. As well as cryolophosauruses. All right, so we're just going to keep building out, uh, you know, different exhibits for these guys as we wait for more to be added. It does look like we're going to need some more generators in this area. We're also going to need more pathways and such, of course, be able to get people all the way there. 
So I'm going to put that there. I guess we could do some uh, some viewing platforms. Might not be the worst idea. Put one there. Put one over here. We do know the, uh, the safety of our people is of utmost importance. We have almost messed that up a couple of times. So we are definitely going to put one of these bad boys here. We want people to be able to get into it very quickly. Unfortunately, it's not going to have the best location, but that's that's okay. So I'm going to put that down there. Let's connect all these. I'm also going to start working on uh, on research. So we might as well get ahead of it while we're here. You know what I mean? I mean, it, eventually we're probably going to have some diseases and stuff we're going to have to take care of. So in the meantime, let's just start with a, uh, a, a nice, you know, beginning foundation. So it looks like one got away from us. We did get two out of three. I'm assuming that these guys are going to be able to work together. So let's uh, let's put these guys in here. Hopefully, they don't need too much space. I for I'm going to guess they want prey, but we'll we'll wait to find out. I don't want to waste any um, any money, but they're definitely going to want some water as well. Let's do like a little line of water there, and um, yeah, our first dinos are going to be in the park. We are looking a little bit low on money. We're negative eighty-seven thousand dollars per minute. That's mainly from our electricity and stuff, but the addition of our first two dinos should be a major, uh, major benefit. Welcome home, fellas. It's good to see you. Technically, we should have, uh, we should have our expedition center going out again. Uh, Al Albertosaurus? Oh, yeah. Okay. Go get him. Just one of them, but that's okay. Gotta be careful about our money. Come on. Start, start bringing stuff in. So, we're, we're gonna want to get the rangers out here. Let's go ahead and, uh, oops, not direct control. I want you to just go do a status quo check on these boys. Let's see what they're gonna be looking for. Get some more data. Berculosis has been unlocked, so that's good. So, we want prey. We want more forest. Water's good, could use more. Area's close, but good. Okay, so we mainly, we mainly want prey. Let's go into our, uh, put some prey down there. Put some prey down there. We're happy. Maybe a little bit of forest as well. So let's grab some, uh, grab some forest here. And we're just gonna load this baby up, especially back in the back. The goats are running. So are these guys though. What's up, buddy? You're kind of cool looking. Look at those markings on his face. He's even, he's got green? I can't wait to see you in the daytime. You look sick. You look like a Call of Duty camo. And with that, we are making some money. Okay, we were honestly really, really close to going broke right there. But hey, at least at least we got it figured out. Okay, so we're going to wait for... Hopefully, we're going to be able to get another meat eater. Going to be able to bring him in here. I guess we can start to get his uh, his thing set up. Of course, we're going to want some uh, some water. I think these guys want a little bit more water too. So we could... I could make that happen. I'll put some more water in the back. Let's put maybe some water here and then a big one back here. Should be pretty good. I guess we could have three. That looks good to me. And, um... Yeah, look at this. These guys are sick. I love this. Please tell me we've got a success. Come on, baby. The Albertosaurus. Yes, sir. Alright. Transport him in here. Hopefully, he's not going to be lonely. I am a little bit worried because there's only one of them. It only gave us the chance to capture one, though. So, I'm going to imagine that he's probably okay. I'm also going to imagine he's going to want some, uh some prey so let's 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 put the goat feeder literally right in front of the viewing platform this guy's got the best view in the house we're gonna control our rangers here Ooh, i don't think okay give me a second i don't think we have we're gonna put a gate right here all right out of task oh no nope. hold on don't turn around yet i hate that i mean i guess it's good that they return to base but when we're waiting for a dino to be delivered, I want them to just, like, hang out and be ready to get him right away. Here we go. Now we're going to be able to add a task, give him a status check, see what we've got going on. Comfort's at 70%. We're missing rock. He's got an ailment. Sand. Everything else is good. Okay, so we're going to send out our medical unit. We're going to add that, go figure out what's going on, and then we're also going to add some uh, some rocks in here. My man likes his rocks. I can, I can appreciate that. I can respect it. Let me just throw a bunch of rocks all over the place. You're, you're going to like my placement. Trust. He is not a happy camper. But I think we found out what's wrong with him. He's got some sort of an ailment. Let's see. Swall he swallowed a phone? He's just got to poop. That's all. 
That's okay. Major injury. Oh, no. That's a mate. He's ringing. You can hear him. My guy must have the gut strength of, of 10,000 freight trains if he can't. I mean, maybe, I mean, the opposite. If he can't pass a cell phone, like, come on, dude. All right, well, we're, we're going to have to, uh, we're going to have to get our boys out. Let's get the bird in the air. Go trank him. We're also going to have to add some sand. So let's go ahead and find the sand. Add this. Give me the, uh, the control here. Here we go. Let's see if we can get him to stop moving. He's running, he's running, he's angry. He ain't happy. I wouldn't be happy if I had a cell phone stuck inside me either. Come on now. I need you to chill out, big big boy. Come on, chief. I'd probably be pretty scared of a helicopter too. Oh, he's going nope. I thought he was going after a goat. Okay, this I thought I was gonna make it more fun by aiming. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to hit him. Oh! Oh! A little bit low. Come on. Oh, he stopped moving. Come on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. All right. That was actually a pretty good shot. So we're going to take our, uh, our transport. We're going to move him over to our medical bay. And uh, let's put our best scientist on it. Now, while this is happening, we should have another two scientists going out on the expedition map. What's a Herrerasaurus? Oh, that's sick. Okay. I'm going to say let's send these two. Start the task. Good luck. And then we do have some scientists that are getting pretty not happy. So, unassigned. Let's go ahead. Oh, we don't have a staff center. We've got to build a staff center. Oops. Staff center could go back here. Let's continue this path like so. And we can connect to this. And then we're going to be able to, to rest our scientists. Should be good. We're going to resupply this. Ooh. Our money is waning. It, it's it's not exactly where we want it to be. It's it's We're kind of floating on an edge here. Ho hopefully we're going to we're going to be able to keep things right. These guys are happy. This guy's being transported over. Staff center just finished. So let's go into our scientists. We're going to have her take a uh, a break. $75,000 to tell him to go on break. I don't know if I appreciate that. You're here now, big boy. You are beautiful. I can't wait to get you all nice and healthy. Everyone's going to love you. We've also... Here, let's, let's check this guy out. Dude, he is sick. I love that. Okay, beautiful. So, over here, we are going to... Uh, we're treating him. 26 seconds. Oop, transmission incoming. Hold on, live capture. Three Harrisaruses have been found and all three have been captured. All right, well, you're gonna have to give me two minutes because I don't even have a, uh, a spot for him yet. So we're now gonna have to expand this, which makes me nervous because I don't know if we're gonna have enough money here. We might be getting too deep. I think we're getting too deep. Hold on. I'm gonna bring this straight out sideways and go up. Gonna bring this here, try to capture as much of this as possible, but then we're gonna be able to come here and go there, beautiful. Okay, that's that's our next one. Uh, these enclosures are, are pretty good sized, to be honest. I, I guess that's a good thing. We're, we're taking care of our, our boys and girls. Okay, so we're gonna come over here. Let's transport this guy back to his setup. Now we're gonna be able to move these three into this setup. We might be able to cohabitate some of these. We'll see. Ultimately, we just kind of want to get them in the park, so we're making money. I've got all of our scientists resting just to, to you know, kind of make sure we don't get in a bad spot. The more dinos that we're adding, the more we have potentially that can go wrong. We just want to make sure that everybody's on the up and up and, and you know, we're, we're good to go. We could potentially add like another, can't we add another science center? And then we, we might be able to hire more scientists. I don't know. We'll see. Let's, let's put the Herosaurus, Herorarosaurus. Looks like this guy's being added in. Again, we're low on money, but hopefully with more dinos, we're going to get more income. He's missing open space. His comfort's at a 70. Let's just come in here. We're going to remove all of this forest, keep some open space for him. How's that looking? He's up to 100%. It's perfect. He'd like a friend. 
but he's okay. All right, we'll take it. Let's get our ranger teams out. We're gonna go do some uh, some checkups on these guys. See what we've got going on. We need to uh, we need to add some ranger outposts. I'm gonna add an outpost in in here. Too close to the dinosaur. I just want to make sure he's in the middle so he, they check everything. Add a ranger outpost there. We're gonna add a uh, a ranger outpost here. Uh, can we get all of those? If we add one here, yeah, that's pretty good. Got it there. Then we're gonna be able to assign these rangers to uh, to each of those. Ooh, undiagnosed ailment. That's okay. So I'm gonna assign the rangers to these, so they're always gonna do status checks on these dinosaurs here. Let's go ahead and get our medical vet unit out. We're gonna check on the health status of these guys. Watch out now, y'all. That was that was a dangerous movement. A dangerous intersection. We need to put like a mirror out here or something. Make sure everyone can see exactly where they're going. We might... Ooh, we've got an injury. Minor fracture. What's the status on that? Feels on its own, but weakens dinosaurs in the meantime. It, it has chances of a major fracture if he's not easy on it. So we've got a minor fracture there. Let's see what we've got here. Minor fracture. Oh, we, we can not just medicate him too. Okay. Well... Let's medicate all these boys and get them back up into ship shape. So with that, we're making some great money now. We've got a bunch of dinos in here making $217,000 per minute. All of our scientists are back to good. Looks like our medical facility is going to need some uh, some fuel. Let's make sure our generator's fueled up as well. Probably don't want to fill it up. Just add a little bit of fuel. I think our rangers are probably going to want some uh, some fuel as well. Resupply and, and food. There it is. All right, and then let's let's send out and try to get some more dinosaurs. Let's see what we've got going on. Allosaurus, Dilophosaurus, six of them. That'll be fun. Yes, please. Let's uh, let's send these two. In the meantime, let's see what we've got going on. Oh, we need we need status checks. Come on, Ranger team. We need we need to find out who's cool with what for like uh, cohabitation purposes. He's by himself. Where are these guys at in here? It's crazy how hard they are to see sometimes. They're all three back in the backpack here. All hanging out. Oh, they got into a little fight. Oh, they're missing some forest. They're upset. So they want forest. They want prey. They want water. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I've been starving you. Got a bunch of forest back in the back. Beautiful. We've got water. We're going to want to add some prey. I, I can't believe I totally forgot to even add food in here. So we're going to do a couple of, couple of preys maybe. One there, one there. Should make them a little bit happier. They're up to 100%. Okay, just be careful. Don't don't fight each other, please. I appreciate it. Oh, he's going after him. He was a hungry boy. He didn't even eat the goat. He just... Now he might. There he is. He threw him like a savage, and then he's, he's going to go slowly eat off of him. So let me see... Are you good with cohabitation to an extent? Are you good with cohabitation to an extent? The thing is, cohabitation with, with carnivores, it just, it's, it's not the best idea. I think, because this, this is our biggest pin here and we, we only have the Albertosaurus in it. I, I think, oh, he is beautiful. Oh, would, would you be cool with some little spitty guys in, in the pen with you? I, I really don't want to make you mad, but I feel like that's going to make my life a, a heck of a lot easier. You know, the, the more separate pins we have to make, the further we have to travel, the more rangers we have to pay, stuff like that. Like, it, it just gets more and more difficult. I'm going to send out another expedition. Let's see what we can get. Allosaurus? Sure, why not? Let's send, uh, send two of our best on it. Start the task. But yeah, I'm, I'm thinking... Oh, oh, he's going after him. Get him, get him, get him. Beautiful. What a good boy. Big blue here. Okay. I'm really hoping he's going to be chill with having them in the pen with him. I feel like usually if you have two, like, really large dinos, they end up fighting. If you have a bunch of small dinos, they end up fighting. But I feel like usually if you mix, it, it turns out okay. How is he doing on space? See, his area isn't great. We may try it. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. But we, we've we've got to start trying to, to do something. 
Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and let's let's make a new make a new setup over here. We bring this perpendicular with our our road. Get this way, and then I guess all the way down to like here, and then we could start bringing it this way. It's solid. I like this. I like where we're going. Ooh. We've got five of them. This this might be too many, but we'll we'll see what happens. I'm just gonna I'm gonna go for it. We're gonna we're gonna hope for the best, expect the worst. Uh, we probably should have saved before doing that. We we could have potentially just got ourselves in trouble, but we're gonna be fine. Let's add a, uh, a s well. We don't need the generator yet because it's not it's not active yet. I really okay. I, I I really hope we're okay. Let me direct control this bad boy. We're dropping in here. We gotta turn this thing around. Our number one objective is going to be to do some, uh, some scouting on these boys. Let's see what we've got going on. Okay, live capture of two Allosauruses. Let's see how it worked out. Nice. Give me another two minutes. We actually have some important stuff going on here. So I'm going to do, I'm going to do some status checks on these guys. He's got a cohab issue. Yeah, he's not happy. Okay, okay. What we're going to do, let's, uh, let's... It's probably going to be easier to move him. I, I feel bad, but definitely. All right, let me add a task. We're going to go trank. Nope, nope, nope. Not that. We're going to go... We're going to go trank him. Are we sure he's not happy? Yeah, he's... He's not happy. And we've got ailments. Okay. Oh, he's... He's he's giving him the, the business. He's giving him the business. Oh, shoot. Please don't get him sick. Hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We're gonna transport him, get him out of here. Get him in, uh, in, in this guy. We're, uh, okay, we gotta work, we gotta work fast. We're, we're probably gonna split this one down the middle. I feel like these are both so big. I honestly feel like we made them way, way too big. We could probably sw split this into quads. I, I think that's, that's gonna be, oop, my plan, shoot. So we're gonna do a, a thing here. He's gonna need some, some prey. We're gonna put down some prey right here. We're gonna do the the viewing platform right here to be able to watch him. We're gonna run a path to that viewing platform. He's gonna need some water as well, and he's also the one that really didn't like the uh, the forest. So we're gonna come take the the forest out here. Take all that out. I believe he likes sand and rocks. Shoot. Transported to the park. Give me two minutes, please. We, we, we're, we've got a lot going on here. Let me add the sand in here. He liked the rocks too, right? Okay. Just add a bunch of rocks in. Okay. How are we looking? We're going to need a, uh, a Jenny over here to be able to power this. Beautiful. That'll be built. Are we happy? We're missing prey. Oh, I didn't... I put the wrong thing down. We don't want that. We want prey. He's at 73%. Area's good. Water's good. Prey is good. Rock is good. Everything's good. He's at 100%. Okay. So he's good. We need to bring our mobile unit out. Our vet unit to come take a look at these guys. See what they've got going on. We also need our ranger team to come do status checks on them and find out what they need. Do we know we're missing forest and an ailment? Forest, prey... They need lots of forest. Okay. So I'm going to say let's let's do at least two preys. We're going to add down some preys here. Beautiful. And we're going to add some forest. Add nothing but forest back in the back. Nicely done. What is... He's diseased with rabies? Oh, shoot. Okay. I'm going to add a task to fix this. Task slots are full. Can I cancel a status check? Shoot. Okay, this this is this is bad. Rabies is really bad. To unlock the medication, we've got to take a picture of the dinosaur with rabies. So give me, give me this guy. I'm gonna take photos. Did I get him? Is that close enough? Shoot. Oh, this is a major issue. They've okay. We have a serious. We have a, a very serious problem. They have they have cut through. That's got to count as a picture, right? Come on, give me the rabies. Give me the rabies vaccine. Here we go. All right. Rabies unlocked. So we're, we're going to want to come in here. We're going to want to research rabies. 
Go to rabies, 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 rabies. Oh, we've already got it. We've already got the medication. Okay. So now we're we're going to add here. We're going to add task. We've got to medicate literally everyone. Unreachable, unreachable. Medicate at least these two. Medicate unreachable. Shoot. Okay. We're going to have to get rid of some of the forest, I think. They're going to be mad for a minute, but that's fine. Okay, everyone's getting medicated. I'm going to put down... Uh, shoot, shoot, shoot. We need a new ranger station, I think. I'm going to put down... We need to repair all these fences. Shoot, dude. This is crazy. We've got a, f a fight going on. Where's our fight at? Oh, shoot. They're all attacking each other. Okay, we're going to have to... We got we to gotta bring out the, the bird, and we're going to have to just... We're going to have to trank everyone. All three of these guys. One. Oop. One, two, two. Okay. Give me two minutes. I, I don't need to add any more dinosaurs. We've already got an issue. Oh! Just chucked his ass. He, de he deserved it. Stop picking fights. Gonna get all these guys. We shouldn't have done these stupid... These, the, oh, no, dude. Dinosaurs can die. Did somebody die? Please don't tell me somebody died. Just just uh, trank everyone. This is so ridiculous. I'm, I'm upset. All right. We're going to need to fix this fence. F fix this fence. Repairs obstructed. The goats are just freely roaming around everywhere. I don't know why the, re the repair is obstructed here. I'm just going to... Oh, it's because we've got a dead dino. We lost a dilf. Okay, that's that's fine. Uh, get, get him out of here. Remove him. Please, thank you. We've got a fight going on over here. We're going to trank both of those guys. Trank this guy. Drink that guy. Everyone's going to be out. Everyone's got to be out, and then we're going to fix everything and, and put everyone back. We lost another Dilophosaurus. Dude. To be to be fair, they, they kind of asked for it. Okay, so these, these guys are good. Just pick them up and put them down. Uh, the Dilophosaurus are, are going to stay in the middle. I forget who was where. MTR, MTR. HRS. HRS. Are you chilling? You're, you're still good? He's still good. We need some comfort data, but it... It looks like he's good. He's, he's still happy. So that at least he's not causing problems for us. These dilfs are, are literally the biggest problem for us. Okay, so we, we've got... The dilfs are going to stay in here. Dilf, dilf. Metra, metra. Dilf. Okay. So we're going to take these metras. Move them here. We're going to take this, move them here. Heading to collect the asset. Metra is going to go over here. Delivered. Dilf is going to go here. Task. Task Unidentified ailment. Dilf has an ailment. Okay. So we're actually going to have to... We literally just woke him up. We're going to have to put him back to sleep. But yeah, he's good. This this guy's over, over here is good. He's chilling. So at least we've got that going for us. We're going to have to add some more force back for the Dilfs. I, to be delivered. honest, I kind of forgot about them, and I think that's part of our problem. I think they were just unhappy. Allosauruses. Let's put these guys in here. I think it's going to be a good spot. So we're going to throw that down. We've got to keep adding to our dinos. Otherwise, this is never going to end. So we, we got we to gotta focus here, Trev. Do that. We're going to be able to add um, a viewing platform. Do that. Add a path to it. Beautiful. We're going to have to expand, too. I'm thinking of going out this way. Get rid of this water here. And then we could start bringing our path out. Maybe... Bring it like this. And then run it along this fence. That's not perfect. I don't think it's ever going to be perfect, but it's it's better there. Okay. So let's bring the, uh... Let's bring the rangers out. We are going to have to add a new... A new ranger setup. I'm thinking probably... Right here. Uh... Or maybe like right in the middle. I think we want them close to, to pretty much everything. Put that there. We're going to be able to put a, uh, a gate right in front of it. We're going to have to do some electricity over yonder. Let's put this here. Beautiful. Shoo, shoot. He's got an undiagnosed ailment. Let me... Almost forgot about this guy. We're going to want to go trank him. How are we doing on happiness for the other ones? They're up to 100%. So they're they're good. They're good. Population's good. Everything's good. Let's check on these guys. 
Beautiful. Let's check on these guys over here. 91%. Why are we not comfortable? Need a little bit more area, a little bit more open space. So let's take out some of this forest. The stakes are as high as they've ever been, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm not mistaken. We are Still on wants the cusp a little bit more of area. Achieving a new relationship with the dinosaurs. Forging revolutionary ideas because we're able to better understand the past. And boy, do we now. No, we're once trying more to put those accidents behind us. Well, if I may, um, there are no accidents. Simply undiscovered reasons. Our mistake, humanity's mistake, is believing that we want to know the truth when the lie is more than enough to sustain us. These genetically manufactured dinosaurs, they're as real as we chose to make them. We've manipulated and crossbred dogs and cats and livestock for years. Why? Not for what they need, but for what we want out of the animals. And you think that's what we're doing now? You tell me. Any contact, no matter how slight and reasoned, introduces change. Is that not correct, Dr. Dua? Enlighten us. For now, it's what we have to accept. I thought we had to move it to the facility. We Our just got to check on them. My job is to make sure these animals have the best care. As for the rest, let come what may. Yes. Yes. How Forced wonderfully uh, uh, chaotic of you. Add some prey here, prey there. We're going to add some forest, and then these guys are going to be happy. We need to really make sure that we're focusing on getting somebody happy and then moving on from that. So let's do that there. Let's see. We're up to 100%. Okay. So 100% on these guys. This guy is 100%. These guys are 100%. These guys are 100%. Except for this one, which we're going to need our, our, our mobile unit out. So as soon as he lands, we're going to send them out, figure out what's going on with him. I guess the rabies stuff is all fixed now, so that's good. As soon as he lands, there it is. Go heal and scan. And then if we check over here, these guys are 92%. They would like a little bit more forest. Okay, we can, we can add forest. Let's get you up to 100%, fellas. How's that? 100%. Let's go. Okay. Whew. We, we got it. We're, we're getting there. Oh, he's got a broken bone. Okay, well, add a task. Go fix it. Oh, it's got a major fracture. Tranquilize and, and take to the facility. Okay, so we are going to have to trank him. So we had to untrank him to trank him. Great. Let's get you to our medical facility. Want to make sure you're, you're all nice and healthy. Even on the islands, we never created something this... This... Perfect. Well, considering we can't let them run free and the dinosaurs will never really know the life they should be living, it's as perfect as can be. I guess. We should be happy. But are we happy? Sorta? Okay, something's bothering you and it's not me. No. So, what gives? This park. This isn't the dinosaur's final stop. Is it? No, of course it's not. How could it be? It's too dangerous to have these animals this close to civilization. Where they go, we go. You mean that, Owen? You realize what you're saying. We're a team. I know you, Claire. You won't turn your back on them. Which is a bad idea, by the way. Never, never do that. And, and neither can I. These animals are a destiny that we can't escape. Not just you and me, everyone. That's something the Earth needs to come to terms with. Yeah, we either make this planet right or the dinosaurs. They'll make it theirs. <laughs> Without a doubt, we gotta learn how to cohabitate with these things. So we're gonna... Ooh, transmission. That's it? Let me keep going. Come on, I was, I was just in the middle of it. Yeah, Yosemite. Huh. We're good. From the language of the Miwok tribe... It means the Valley of the Killers. Fitting, isn't it? The strong prey on the weak, the hunter and the hunted constantly optimizing their size, their appearance, their strength, their vision, their speed. The mind becoming ever better at that one task necessary for survival. 
Huh. Evolution is a never-ending arms race that continues to this day. That's life. It embraces change. And now dinosaurs have returned to the Valley of the Killers. The question isn't, do they belong in Yosemite? They most certainly do. No, no, the question is, will they stay? Hmm. I don't think so. I don't think you can contain them. So there we have it. That, my friends, I believe is the end of the, um, the campaign. Honestly, really good. I, I enjoyed it. Yeah, it's kind of, you know, an introduction to the game, Chaos Theory. Uh-oh, well done on completing the campaign mode. Why not try Chaos Theory? Help Dr. John Hammond realize his dream of Jurassic Park while learning the fundamentals of creating a safe and profitable park for the guests. So yeah, we, I mean, there are other, you know, modes, challenges, Chaos Theory, Sandbox, everything we could do. Um, I, I don't know. There's some other games I want to play right now. We... I honestly just really enjoy this. I wish we could have completed this back when the game first came out and we were super hyped about it. We'll see what happens. If you guys want to see more, we could potentially do it. But obviously, you know, February is coming up. We've got some games even at the end of January. Like, it's... There's a lot of cool stuff on the way, so I want to make sure I, I leave room on the channel for that. But um, we'll see. So, let me know what you guys think. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you guys did. Subscribe if you haven't already. Peace out.